throat. Emily Caldwin is still missing. Any person with information that leads to her discovery will be granted a substantial reward.
We got a prowler on the loose. <laughs> no, no, stupid cut. Emily Coleman is still missing. Any person with information that leads to her discovery will be granted a substantial reward. Up ahead. Try to find out where Tim is. There's an equipment stash on the rooftops nearby. We've been anticipating doing a hit on Tim for some time. I know. Half the city wants him dead. We'll earn some gold on this one. I'll meet you up ahead. It's Dowd, isn't it? You wouldn't be in this district unless you were after Timsha's head. 
What do you want? Revenge. To do to Timsh what he did to me. I want him homeless, a victim of one of his own eviction documents. I've prepared one, complete with the forged signature of the Lord Regent. Please, go to my old apartment. It's right next to Timsh's estate. Here's the address, but I doubt you can get inside from the streets. There you'll find my journal, which contains the entire plot and everything you'll need. But you're a businessman like I once was. I don't expect you to do this for free. If you do go to my apartment, you'll find something stashed there. Consider it your payment in advance. The barrister dying would be nothing to me. I want him to see his own ruin. I want him to taste it. You think I'm being needlessly cruel? You don't know what he does all day then. Fancy barrister Arnold Timsh signs a document, then the watch is at your door, dragging your wife into a plague wagon. I fought. Didn't even know I could fight. I broke a man's nose. I wish they killed me. You don't know what's happening in this city until you've seen the flooded district. I crawled over bodies. I don't even know if they were alive. You don't know what's happening in this city until you've seen the flooded district. I crawled over bodies. I don't even know if they were alive. him up just to be safe. He seems familiar to me. Reminds me of someone who used to do business with Timsh, but I'm not sure. Good work, Simmons. Now that that's handled, we can move on. You got the orders from Timsh, right? What's the next address? Crow's Court off Brambley Street. But there's a problem, sir. The Forestalls live there, and their kids used to sneak us food at the back door. I know it's the job, sir, but it's awfully hard seeing them turned out like this. They don't even have the plague. I've been there last week. Excellent. Simmons, you'll show me this back stoop and we'll go in that way. Start tallying the place up. You've given us the tactical advantage. We'll get Timsh's money. But, sir... I'll put it another way. You think I care which door we kick in tomorrow? The next day? Behind each is another useless pack of aristocratic sots and their precious offspring. And I don't care if they all end up mudlarks. Sir, they've been good to me. Simmons, before I worked for Barrister Timsh, I was dredging out the real weeper dens. You ever done that? Ever broken down a door and bathed in that stench? Fought housewives with blood on their faces, swinging at you with a piece of broken furniture. Other times it's just rats inside, hundreds of them, stripping some drunk to the bone. Maybe you'd like to be transferred to my old squad. No, sir. Certainly not. I used to call myself Brave, Simmons. Till I saw a man lose a fight with a pile of rats. So when Barrister Timsh says all I gotta do is rough up a rich bastard, cuff him a few times till he stops talking about his rights, I jump at the chance. I cry with happiness. You understand me? Yes, sir. We'll approach from the back stoop. They won't be alarmed when they see me. Right. Good man. It's them or us. No room for heroes in the time of plague. You just do your job and I'll make sure you keep this posting. Oh, this is just ridiculous. Stupid rats. Plague. <laughs> Lixir. Bunch of crap.
General's on his way. Things got nasty in the upper city. We handled it. One less mess for the watch to clean up. justifying himself to the rats in his office right now. 
just inside the top balcony. There he is. See him? I imagine you... I'll stick around if you don't mind. I'd like to watch. Things are bad. Could the city get any worse? Indeed, I believe so. Citizens belonging to or offering aid to the Hatter criminal organization will be restrained or killed. Tell me again what you'll do if Slack John is Bottle Street Boys junk. Plug someone else. to keep this position. He says to bring a bottle, I bring a bottle. He says to bring food, I bring food. He says to undress, I undress. This whole place has gone to the hounds.
I was a baker's apprentice in Dunwall Tower. A friend to Jessamy and the Noble Girls. Then afterward, I made my name as a painter. Now, I'm obviously something much greater. I hope that satisfies you. Because you won't get more. I ought to just kill you. But I'm going to give you a warning for the sake of my sisters. We were very impressed with you once upon a time. Stay away from me. There are great changes coming, and I'll expect you not to interfere. I have influence in places you won't expect. But as for Arnold Timsch, do what you want. I won't hold a grudge. I'm done with him. Is that who you were looking for? Well, she's a bit of a bitch, and the artwork's hopeless. I know you have your reasons. <laughs> <laughs> 